What's up, UHS hardware fans? It's me, Louie. Here we are today. I'm gonna to give you a really quick run through on how to cut 206 dimple keys for the DeGuard high security locks and cylinders. We're gonna use the SEC E9 to trace the key, the original, and we're also going to use the actual duplication card that comes with it to cut by code. So come with me, we're gonna do it really quickly. In order to start cutting dimple keys on your SEC E9, you'll first need to purchase, install, and calibrate the dimple clamp for the SEC E9, as well as the dimple cutter and dimple decoder, all available at uhs-hardware.com by searching for SEC Dimple. You can also get a direct link to each of these products below in the description. To produce our 206 dimple key, we're gonna go into dimple, then head down to multi-lock, and then we select interactive 236. We're gonna input our code since we're copying from the card. So our card, we can see here, says BZADC30144. As you can see here, our inputs are four digits each, so it's four and four. You're actually going to skip the second letter and second number in your series here. So instead of it being BZ, it is B. A, D, C, three, zero, one, four, four. As you can see, neither of those letters or numbers is available. So next, now we're gonna hit OK to continue. The first thing we're gonna do is put in our blank, line it up with the first tip stop, and then we're gonna hit cut. Everything's good. Here we go. All right, so now I'm just gonna confirm that our first cut is ready and I'm going to hit okay. Now we're moving on to our second cut. All right, so now I'm gonna flip over the key. Line it up again. Continue. Yes to confirm. Okay, now that we reach 50% in our cut, we're just gonna confirm that the first ones are done. Move on to the inner pin cutting. That key is complete. See how we did. Tap it off. Okay, so I'm just gonna go ahead and test it here. This was the key that was just cut by code. That's a beautiful seamless turn. All right, let's get them out. Number one down. All right, so next we're gonna decode by the key as if we lost our card. So I'm gonna go straight back into dimple again, and then in, down to multi-lock, back to interactive 236. And now I'm going to decode. Okay, step is gonna to be to put our original key in, align with the first tip stop. Now that we got the key in, I'm gonna hit decode. All right, everything's good to go. Confirming, yes. Okay, confirming again, we're good to go. Get our new blank in there, line it up with that first tip stop. And now we're gonna hit cut. All right, so now that we've finished the first cut, we're gonna go ahead and flip our key and continue, cut to the next side of the key. Now 
how we remove the key. This key. Our key we cut by decoding. Full turn. Perfect cut. That's it. We did it really quick, really simple. It's super easy to decode a key and to also cut by code using the SEC E9. Uh, both keys worked perfectly fine. No issues here. If you want to get yourself any of the products here on this table, go ahead and visit uhs-hardware.com. There's also going to be a link below in the description. If you're not already following us on social media, today's the day. Go ahead and check out the links I have in the description for that as well. Please leave a comment down below. We love hearing from you guys. Also, make sure to like and subscribe. Hit the bell. Make sure that you know as soon as a new video comes out from us. Make sure you drop down below into the comments and leave hashtag UHS Hardware. We still have plenty of these awesome mats to give away. Lock mats free for you right now. Hashtag UHS Hardware. Thank you for coming by. Thanks for sticking with us and checking out the video. We'll see you guys next time.